done quite a lot this morning, guys. We arrived here at what time? We arrived at nine o'clock. Um, we were booked in for a full body MLT. Um, and now in Turkish, I've got the proper price around there, but I think it's about 2,000 lira too. 2,600 lira. Um, so, but I'll, you know, I'll get the correct prices for you guys. Um, but so far, I mean, it has been fairly incredible the experience. So we, we came here, um, we met a guy named Charlem. Um, and basically he's a representative that is appointed to stay with us for the duration of this process because he speaks perfect English. And that's how they, they do it here. Um, they'll appoint you somebody, whatever your language is, whether it's English, German, um, and they'll stay with you for the duration of your of your visit. So today we've already had um, CT scan, MRI, which I want to tell you was a crazy, hairy experience, very noisy. I'm, I'm a person who, who I often get quite claustrophobic, so I kind of found the experience to be quite hard. It's eight minutes of your life, um, but I don't like lying on my back and I get a bit claustrophobic, so it's a bit difficult. What was it like for you two? I was fine. I was fine with it. I just closed, I went in, as soon as, it, before it started, I closed my eyes and just, just tried to just relax into it. It was just loads of different noises, tapping, buzzing, you know, but I was fine with it. Um, yeah, no, I was fine, so I don't, I don't suffer from claustrophobic or anything. I could see why people would suffer like find it hard to deal with and they give you the little panic i think that made it worse the minute she gave me the panic button i was like what do i need this for yeah and i think um, that kind of made it worse as well. so you do get to have earplugs as well if you need them um but i think it's putting the the head brace thing on first okay so it's kind of like oh my god what's this going to be like because a lot of people say it's very noisy and you move and it moves i find the moving fine um the whole th i was fine with it it was fine for me you know, and and the mammogram that was like oh. the mammogram. So go on, give us a little breakdown of that. So the mammo mammogram, um, you have to put your booby onto this little platform thing, and then they have this plastic thing that squashes it down, and then you have to do your up. You have to do obviously first of them, your both of them, and then right, and then left, and then you have to turn and put it on. It squashes it down. <laughs> There's a lot of squashing. My little boobies. <laughs> so the star of the show though is this man here. He's not very happy at the moment. Um, he's the star of the show because we also paid for Mari to have um, the MRT, but because of his age, um, it's he's something that they don't do here. But today Mari's had to have a, a urine test, which he wasn't quite pleased with, and he's also had a blood test. And as you can see, this is somebody who's had a blood test. He's not happy at all. I'm not going to force it, but he's not happy. But let me tell you something, guys. Uh, for eight years old, he was such a brave boy. Very brave. No one likes injections. He's gonna get a big tree. Um, and courtesy of the service, we get this meal. Um, and it's all included in the price. So, Sorry, just right in all part of the service here at the S9 Hospital. So we'll, we'll catch up with you guys, give you an update in a bit. Uh, they, they, they give you whatever language you speak into, you'll get a representative. So this is Charles now. Hello again. <laughs> so we uh, we started off with giving a pee sample. Blood. Blood test, urine. urine. <laughs> we had our ears tested, ear which was quite interesting. They, they put something in your ear that kind of seems to intensify the pressure. Plus you had a sound test yeah. uh, with headphones and you, you press the button for reaction. Ultrasound. Uh, ultrasound. Me. Yeah. Tracy's had a mammogram. <laughs> Chest x-ray. Chest x-ray. MRI. MRI. Um, and again, Amari's... And we got here at 9 o'clock? Very quick. Very quick. Amari's had um, a, a, a check over. He's also had a scan, CT scan. Ultrasound, ultrasound, ultrasound. So, and I just think, you know, we've, we've had lunch, and I just think everyone's been really excellent. Service here has been fantastic. We've even had a meal, um, which, which we showed you. So everything's been excellent. What's next? Gynecologist. 
Okay. <laughs> okay. So yeah, Trace is off to see the good old guy now this afternoon. <laughs> so that should be interesting. So guys, we're right outside the, the Ozu Lockman Heckam Esnap Hospital. But look at that. Right across the road, you've got like some lovely, the lovely sea and restaurants right across the road. So that's something that, what a nice set. I mean, nobody wants to be ill. Of course not guys, but if you are, you know, not a bad place to come and get your treatment. And the hospital grounds are really well looked after. And I bet this tree stops tree hugging. Will stop tree hugging. So there you go, guys. If you're official tree hugger, uh, I don't recommend <laughs> hugging this tree anytime soon. So, quick catch up. So we just had obviously the fit test i came out sweating i'm a sweater anyway guys but i had no mask on i've come out sweating and a, a guy old an old fella came up to me and handed me a tissue oh, i think they might have thought i had covid <laughs> <laughs> and i think and one lady was sitting next to me quite close proximity she got up and moved over so i think people were a bit scared look we're still in this covid time oh. so there you have it but uh what we got next guys so next I think we've got eyes. Um, Amari's got to. We, 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 there's a couple moles on Amari. I don't think there's anything to worry about, but they're going to have a little look at that. Um, and then I think we just. They'll just look. Not, not they'll just look, son. Nothing, nothing, nothing harsh. Then after that, I think it's just sitting there and get their results. So, you know, um, again, guys, you know, I'm not very good with. Being How forewarned. Quick it was to get the appointment as well, because I, what did I, I think I emailed last week, Thursday. Okay. Uh, contact me back the same day, booked me appointment the same day to come in today, the 21st. Wow. So it's very quick, very quick communication, no waiting around. You know, I know we're paying for it, but sometimes you have to still wait a long time to get an appointment even when you're paying. And like I said, we'll put the full price down, uh, you know, in the video. It's going to be down there, guys. Down there, look down there. And this is private healthcare. But I'm just so happy with the standard. And not only that, I just feel like I'm, I'm, I feel like I'm being well looked after. Yeah. You know, um, so really happy with the service. And the hospital is immaculate. The toilets were better than some restaurants, honestly. I think they cleaned every half an hour super clean hospital uh really you know amazing uh, amazing healthcare so far